So as humans, we tend to view the world through our own lens. And then we tend to incorrectly assume that others have this same lens as well. And then, of course, we are upset or bothered when we discovered that they do not. And as humans, we tend to fall in the trap of wanting people to be like us and thinking people are like us. So the solution to this is obviously, firstly, to understand how you process things. And then secondly, how the other person you are relating to processes things as well which in this context in the in a romantic relationship will obviously be better beneficial and useful for everyone just as a caveat of course these are just generalizations these are just basic principles of course there's variation and variety within the human experience because obviously that's what the video is about but in order to speak about something you need to have some degree of generality and i can i couldn't just sit here and spend 12 hours talking about a thousand different permutations and manifestations that would just be ridiculous so with that out of the way just in a, as a general thing that i noticed a lot over the years in my life that i've seen in my life and others is that especially in modern times a lot of women want men to be more me be more emotional that's kind of like the social meme um which personally speaking i don't think that's really the best uh <laughs> path i think there's a lot wrong with that i think obviously yes having more emotional intelligence and being able to regulate your emotions is useful but being more emotional following your feelings more especially as an adult man is not a great thing it's not a great message and we can kind of see already the negative consequences of that so following that idea women many of them want men to be more emotional because that's maybe how they are that's maybe how they process events and then men on the flip side want women to be more logical and more rational because maybe that's how they tend to process events and that's it's just kind of like the whole generic cliche of men are from Mars, women are from Venus, which if you're not familiar with that book and check it out, it's basically this concept. So it, this basically creates a lot of conflict and creates a lot of scenarios where people don't feel understood. They don't feel appreciated. They don't feel seen. So in this example, women don't feel seen or heard emotionally. They're not feeling understood. And then because maybe the man's like, oh, we'll just do this, maybe just do that, maybe look at it this way, maybe look at it that way. But that they're not really in a problem-solving kind of mindset. They're more so like, mm -hmm. let me sort through what I feel and just process through those feelings, and that's all I really need to do. But then the guy's like, well, hold on. I need to use logic and rationality and problem-solving and you know solve this thing. And it's like, well, that's not really appropriate right now. But then on the flip side, men can also not feel valued or appreciated for their logic and problem-solving skills because maybe in a different scenario, their partner is not seeing and appreciating those things and allowing those things to have a beneficial impact on the relationship. Why is that occurring? Because we, we think we are this way, so we want other people to be like this way. And that, of course, just creates conflict because if those people aren't that way, then they're not going to feel seen or heard or appreciated. And it's going to create conflict and strife and disagreement. When in actuality, this, the solution is quite simple, which is understanding that we all process things a little bit differently and maybe just spending a few minutes trying to understand how that other person processed things and then trying to find some common ground in the middle to be able to actually communicate and relate to each other and realize that maybe at different times we need different things. Sure, maybe as a guy you have times where you just want to process or vent your feelings, but maybe also... A, the majority of the time you're just going to be focused on logic rationality problem solving and same thing for females maybe there's times where you just want to do this there's other times where you just want to do the other thing so basically again the solution is to understand how you process things within yourself figure out how the other person does and develop some baseline level of self-awareness and empathy